結構タイムラグがあるのかな。はい。Oh, hi guys. Can you hear me? Guys, let me know if you can. Oh, yes, yes, you can hear me. Oh, hi guys. I'm just gonna be holding a live for a few minutes via uh, until all the camera gear is set up behind me. No, it's, that's okay. <laughs> is that a bad thing? Hey guys, let, let me know where you're from. Hi guys, oh, Germany. Oh, hi Wendy, how's it going? Philippines, nice, nice. Ravi from India, nice. Bruce Wayne, <laughs> Bruce Wayne from California. El Salvador, oh, living in the US. Yeah, this place is really nice, right? We are right now setting up some cameras and uh, lights for our shoot today for the video recording. Uh, so yeah, if you, so I've got two courses, the workouts course and the secrets course. So if you have any suggestions on the combinations that you like to learn, or if you have this problem with karate for a long time and you wanna get, uh, I would say over it, you wanna solve that problem, let me know in the comments section so, so I can actually implement it to the actual um, online course. The karate. Okay, much love again from Texas. Thank you so much, Q Karate. I combine styles, but Shotokan is where I pull from, pull from many, from mainly because it's a strong style in my opinion. I do agree. It has a wide range of techniques. A lot of people think uh, we only do punches and kicks, but we have throws too, and locks. So um, I think it's a very, I would say, um, overall, very wide style. Okay, I'm seeing myself here too. Okay. Huh. Okay, all right. Let me get back to your questions. <clears throat> Veniskia. Hi, hi guys. Konbanwa uh, gozaimasu. Oh, it, it's usually just konbanwa. Ohayou gozaimasu. That's um, good morning. Um, konbanwa is just used as konbanwa. I don't know why. Watching you from Peru. Thank you so much. I'm an un Ravi, but I am unable to increase my school strength. Uh, school th strength? What do you mean by that? Do you mean your power for the techniques? I guess in terms of Increasing your power. Mm. Of course, work, workouts are important. Consec doing movements consecutively is important. Uh, but could you tell me a little bit more? What's the best way to do a backward shoulder roll? Backward shoulder roll. What is that? <laughs> backward. Christine, I'm not sure if if I'm understanding you correctly. What is your favorite kata or waza? Um, for the kata, uh, I would say, uh, 
I like simple katas, like Gion, MP, those katas. Um, on. Ah, thank you. So, yeah, yeah, I like to do those simple katas. And for the waza, um, I don't... Mm, I, I like kicks, mainly. Roundhouse kicks to the stomach, those are my favorite. So I usually pay attention to which muscles to use, or uh, I usually focus on the techniques in order for the opponent to not notice my punch or the kick to come. So a lot of it um, I think I cover in my YouTube channel and on this online video course um, as well. So number of students, number of strength of school. Mm -hmm. Flying Izana Kurosawa, flying kick or block. するためにフックキックをどのように使用しますか。How do you use a hook kick to block a flying kick? Um, I wouldn't. If the guy's doing a flying kick, basically, I guess jumping up and kicking me, I would just back off or just uh, change the angle. I wouldn't uh, use my hook kick to counter it. That's just my way. Do you do anything other than karate? Of course, I cross train here and there, but mainly it's karate. Uh, and as a video course, um, I, I can't do a backflip. I gotta learn that first, <laughs> to be honest. Oh, hi sensei from uh, Adrian. Adrian, Adrian. Um, hello from Mississippi. Uh, Combination on knife hand block, oh, knife hand blocks and spear hand thrust. Oh, that was actually what we're gonna be shooting today. Um, the, the main focus for today's video shoot is going to be uh, knife hand blocks, shitoke in Japanese. So, oh wow, I guess you <laughs> you guessed it correctly. Um, I guess they, um, you know, I like you to check the full tutorial um, on the video course, but uh, to give you the key components, I think it's about um, not pushing out, but pulling the knife head into you. If you can use your triceps to pull the knife hand block, then it'll be very, very powerful. Um, uh, sir, can we combine jujitsu with karate kumite? Yes, that's actually wadoryu. That's the whole theme of wadoryu. Ah, Christine, I like MP and nai hanchi kata. Nice, wow. I like waza that end in with a good throw. Oh, I see, I see. Nai hanchi. Some of you might know it as tekki. This, this is actually, you know, this movement. This one. This is a, this is a throw. So, very knowledgeable. Nice one. Okay. O hiru wa nani wo tabemashita ka? En sota san. What did you eat for lunch? I had uh, bread. I had bread and coffee for my lunch. How long should we be training a day? Um, I know everybody is busy, right? So, I mean, as long as you can, I would say, sweat and feel good about that day, I think it's good. So, around 15 minutes of intense karate workout. Uh, would be ideal, you know. Um, you know, starting from the warm up, five minutes, and then ten minutes, intense, fast pace, like full speed basics, kihon, um, with the footwork. Don't just do it in the same spot. You gotta add footwork. You gotta step back, step forward, step to the side, jump up, slide down. Those movements will get you in a pretty good um, condition. So that's how I, uh, you know, design my online course too. Um, you start off. You always start off with warming up stretching the body, and then you have to do uh, exercises with using your, using your legs. Okay. Uh, where, where was I? Uh, video idea. Show Kihon comparison from different styles with other karatekas like Shotokan versus Kyokushin versus Gojiro. Ah, great idea, great idea. I actually did um, a kata comparison with Shitoryu. So that one you can check out um, for sure. Okay, so I guess um, I was, yeah, when I practice, I usually practice to a point, I just set one topic for that day, 
So for instance, just focus on knife hand block, Stoker for that day. And I break down the movement. I try to you know, go slowly. Slow practices are extremely important, guys. So practice very slowly and get used to moving the body precisely in a slow way. Um, for instance, like Stoke, don't just, don't just put the hand out. You gotta rotate your wrist to the end point. And that has to match completely with the pullback. So checking the timing, those are very important when you, you know, practice daily. Um, do you practice Kobudo? Not, I don't spend a huge amount of time on Kobudo, to be honest. But I, I am planning on doing it in the future. Uh, do you actually rest on rest days or do you sneak in a few? I rest completely. <laughs> I rest. Oh, I guess I do teach. So I have my online classes almost every day. So I do karate every day, but you know, teaching is a little bit different from actually working out. So to answer your question, I guess I do sneak in just extremely light karate practices, but not so heavy. I would say. Mm, I can't believe you guys are on. What time is it, guys, uh, in, your, in, your, in your region? And right now we are in Tokyo. It is um, almost 1 p.m. right now. I can never rest. <laughs> I have two classes a week, but I always work out. Oh, that's great. That's great, that's great. Lunchtime in the Philippines. Right, right, right. Uh, salmon way. What should I do to increase the speed of my mawashigiri? In Kumite, I'm too slow in mawashigiri. Mm, mawashigiri. Why? Why would you want to? Why? Why do you feel your mawashigiri to be slow? Could you let me know a little more? Maybe it's not about the speed. Maybe it's about when you're kicking, or maybe it's about how you're kicking. Oh, 11 p.m. Eastern, 9.51. Kyoto, Kyoto, I mean, I'm in Tokyo, so the time is the same. Uh, oh, Brunei, Brunei, there's only one hour difference. I did not know that. Cleveland, Ohio, 10.52. Mm, I see, I see. Mm -hmm. Oh, guys, just, just a moment, guys. Right. 9 a.m. 9.22 in India. Nice, nice. Chile. Oh, it's almost midnight. Oh, it is midnight. <laughs> Show some love and get those likes up, y'all. Yeah, thanks so much, Dom. Uh, what's the best style for street defense? I use practice Shorin Ryu, Kobujutsu. Uh, if it's within karate, which do? Which do I think is really good. Which do? Mm. So let me show you guys the behind the scenes a little bit. So, yeah, as you can see, oh, it's a bit bright. Yeah, this is the whole gym. Um, it has it has a little bit of cushion on um, the floor. So it's not a hard wooden floor. It has a bit of a cushion here and this is where we basically shoot the let me share this with you yeah we opened this web so oh, it's we opened this video course um, at the beginning of October um, it has a free seven-day trial so you can try it out for free um, it has two courses here one for the more I would say experienced people so if you already have karate experience, but you feel like there's just something that you're missing from your local schools, or maybe if you practiced it in, in the past and you have a good basis, but you want to build up on, on top of that, 
uh, this is the video course for you, Hidden Karate Principles. So um, I've taken, for instance, the first two topics uh, that we covered already were number one, toe slide. This one, toe slide. The chapter one was toe slide. Uh, basically, if you are struggling with balancing your, sta your stance or you feel like your attacks are very short, uh, this is the course for you. By sliding in from your toes, you can solve all those problems. And I, saw, and I explain uh, why you should do it and how you can activate that movement and how you can actually apply it to kata, kumite, and kihon. So that's the first chapter. Second chapter is the iliopsoas muscle usage. This is for people that are struggling with getting faster kicks or getting the faster footwork. If you feel like your movements are slow when you do katas, this is the course for you. Um, you, can, you can subscribe to this course for $25 a month and you will get new videos every single month coming to your, uh, coming to your I would say, account. So I think it's a, <laughs> honestly, I think it's a pretty good deal uh, because the more you, the, the more you, I would say, take the course, the more, I would say, aspects you learn about karate. And even if you don't do karate, like taekwondo, boxing, you can apply this skill. So this is the more, I would say, this is the course for the more um, expert or the more um, experienced people. So I'm out of the loop. Please explain to us what is the Karate University. The Karate University is, the, is my online video course that we started. So you can check it out. Uh, I, I think I pinned the link in, up, in, up, up above so you can check it out. So this is the first course out of the two courses I have. The first course is the Hidden Karate Principles. The second course is, oops. If you're doing evening session, Oh wait, sorry, I missed that. Yeah, this is the second course, Karate Workouts. This is for people that wants to get healthy and lose some weight, but is tired of going to the gym or just doing the same, I would say, like workout routine on YouTube. I will send you around five to six individual videos related to karate that you can sweat and just exercise. So this, yeah, if you don't need karate experience, this is for people um, that don't have karate experience, or if you have karate experience, you can brush up your techniques uh, using this course. So I've got um, two, cha two, I would say, chapters already, one for October, one for November, and how it's constructed or how it's broken up is on Mondays, you learn the kicks. On Tuesdays, you learn the punches. Uh, Wednesday, footwork. Thursday, block. Friday combination, so getting all that together and practicing it. So I think it's a pretty, oh, I, I, I'll give you a, a special <laughs> insider to, who, to see it. So if you, you can actually check this out uh, by signing up for free for seven days. So, you know, please go ahead and check it out yourself. But for instance, like karate workouts, you can click here Okay, and this is what the actual course looks like. It starts with the warm up. This is the warm up. And then right here are all the lessons that you can check out. Like, for instance, let's check out the combo, right? This is the Karate Combo Friday video. Okay. Off video. Okay, now like this. Other side, okay? You know, it has the music. Okay. Right. This. Left, you know, it has the music. Left, oh. right. So the sides are flipped. Okay, let's do it slowly. Like, Ready? you know, it's taking Eight. slowly. One, two, kick and punch. So, you know, it's, it's a fun way to just practice karate and put it into your daily life. The, each video is around 10 minutes long, so it's not too long. You can put it into your daily practices. And yeah, I have this. Um, for, uh, with the music and without the music. So yeah, please feel free to check it out, guys. This is the overall outline of the Karate University. One for the video course, I mean, one for the uh, Karate workouts, the other for the uh, principles, hitting Karate principles. So let me answer your questions again, going back. <clears throat> Where was I? Normally, I exercise, then I practice. Ah, that's a good routine, I think. 
you know, always warming up the body, right? サンドバッグを強くけて穴を開けたり、スラストキックを使ったり、師匠と一緒に一日ごろ、お練習し、あ、しました。Okay. Well, that's a very, very long time. Five to ten hours. Wow. What do you do for a living? Which one is your best drink after or while doing karate? I usually just drink water.、Uh, but I think any sport、uh, related drinks、uh, would be acceptable too.、Uh, any tips on the jump on Unsu? I have a championship tomorrow. Oh, jump on Unsu.、Um, don't focus on kicking with the left leg. Use the right leg to swing yourself up.、Uh, that's more important. Oh, okay. Okay, it's gonna get a little bit dark. I think, I think you'll see a sudden change. Ah, nice. <laughs> Looking much, much better now.、Um, oh, where was I? Sir, I'm a black belt going for second dawn test next month. Do you have any tips?、Uh, <laughs> I mean, what are you gonna be doing for the test? What makes you like karate? I think it's about.、Um, I like it when you can actually listen to your body and notice new things about what your body can do.、Uh, I like that aspect of karate. Nice, sir. I want to buy, but I have some doubts. <laughs> yeah, some doubts. <laughs> Very honest.、Uh, what makes you.、Uh, where was I? Watashi no shisho wa sofu. Watashi no sofu de. I see. Oh, okay. You're a student. That's why you can practice that much time. Very good. Very impressive.、Uh, what is the session for today?、Uh, today, we are going to be doing、uh, workouts, workout videos. So, we are shooting,、uh, I would say, five, five videos mainly the Karate Punch,、uh, Karate Kick Monday, Karate Punch Tuesday, Karate Footwork Wednesday, Karate Block Thursday, and Karate Combo Friday. Uh, for my online video course of the karate workouts. That's what we will be shooting today. And we're taking some B rolls and I would say int introduction, like talking videos. So that's going to be the main,、uh, main videos for today. You know, there are around,、uh, currently there are around 50 something students enrolling in my class in, in the、uh, video course. So, you know, feel free to join us. How long have you been doing karate as a profession? As a profession,、um, I would say、um, the definition of profession is a bit difficult, but、um, I would say th three years almost.、I've, as a coach, as like a student coach, when I was in college, I was coaching the high school students and middle school students as well, including that seven years. Yeah, yeah. So it's, it's been a, so four years coaching and then three years. Uh, doing this you know, online karate um, uh, event.、Uh, do you have a favorite kata? And Jion and MP, probably. I'm training、um, gankaku right now. Gankaku. It's called chinto in other styles. Good evening. I really enjoy your work with Okinawa Sensei. Ah, thank you so much, Christian. Okay, Chris. I've just graded tonight. Oh. I'm one away from my black belt. Oh, congratulations, Chris. I hope my videos helped you out too. Followed you after seeing a video of your college daily. Oh, all、oh, right, right, right. That was, <laughs> that was quite some time ago. I think that was like four years ago. Very long time ago.、Uh, do you recommend any books on karate do? More on the spiritual side. Spiritual side. Mmm. Why don't you, if you can read Japanese, there are a couple novels that I would recommend.、Mm. To be honest, I haven't read any English karate books. So I can recommend you some Japanese one if you can read it. Do you like the Hangetsu Kata? I do like it, but it's very different.、Um, different and difficult, I think, from the normal Shotokan Katas. So I still need to practice. Mm -hmm. Oh, Chris, thank you so much. I'm glad they helped you out. So, yeah, I guess the setup is getting ready gradually, like this.
Let me take you guys around. Okay. So. Oh, today is this light. Do you need my light? Do you need Fancy setup, Tai Chi. Oops. Oh, this is the actual. Oh, I guess it's gonna be color graded from here. But, oops. This is how the video looks like, and that's the. Yeah, yeah. This is the before and after. And then, oh yeah, you see the lights here. What else? All right, this is really cool, right? You can change the, how do you call it? Uh, what's the K stand for, Kelvin? Kelvin. So, color temperature. Color temperature. Yep. You can change the color temperature with this. Yeah, the Japanese flag is lit up with that one. <laughs> that, one. <laughs> that little dude right there. <laughs> is that the university dojo? Um, this place can be rented by anybody. It's offered by the district of uh, Shinjuku. So anybody can rent this place. And we are using this place to shoot our videos for the video course because it looks very nice and it's very spacious. You know, not, not a lot of schools have this much space, including mine. So we are using this one for the shoot. So we can set up the lights, you know, a lot of cameras. Hi, oh, hi, Martin. Oh, sorry for the light, guys. Oh, Vince, thank you so much. Oh, I'm so scared. Good evening, Yusuke-san. I've uh, been following you for a while. I've returned to Shotokan after a very long break. My sensei is a former senpai who was fortunate enough to meet Kanazawa sensei. Oh, that's great. I, I suspect, I assume you're from Europe, maybe the UK. <clears throat> very nice, very nice. I hope my videos help you out, guys. So maybe I can take you on a short tour around the facility. So this is the dojo, right? I mean. This is the dojo, and then outside here, there is a door. If you open it, it's just the usual hallway here. And there is a, that's the Kudo, Kudo place for Japanese archery. <laughs> and that's just the hallway. So I don't wanna, I don't wanna bother everybody else. So I'll be back here. But yeah, this is a very, um, it's just a place that, that everybody enjoys martial arts. Uh, I'd love to know those books in Japanese. Oh, yes, um, let me, let me, give me, give me a moment. The Japanese books. The Japanese books, uh, oh. Just a sec. Uh, it's, it's from Bin Konno. That's the author's name, Bin Konno. And the book is called Gichin no Ken, The Fist of the Gichin, Gichin Funakoshi. So all his books, basically um, he has a lot of books on, ja on the Japanese legendary teachers like Matsumura Sokon. Uh, the founder of Shorin, uh, or basically the Shurite karate styles. And he puts it in a story narrative. So it's very easy for you to read, and it's not like reading a textbook. So I heavily recommend those. Kondo Bin san. Bin Kondo. That's the uh, name of the author. Okay. We don't have any dojos in Kuwait, so I have traveled so much just to get to the dojo. Kuwait. Oh, I see. I mean, I, I have a few students in my online courses. I mean, on, in my private lesson, she's from Kuwait. 
So, and she says she has a couple of schools around her. So I guess it depends on the region, right? <clears throat> also, oh, have you thought about teaching Japanese? Um, like as a profession, not really. But I do have some videos on my channel uh, related to um, Japanese used in karate. Mm -hmm. What's the difference between a simps? Sensei, sensei, not sai, sensei, and senpai. Sensei means a teacher, senpai means somebody older than you. So senpai is not a, I would say, it's not a level you have to go through before becoming a sensei. It's used pretty incorrectly in English. It just means somebody older than you. So it's not like a rank. It just means somebody older than you. Mm. Oh, cool. Thank you so much. No more like kara private lessons. What do you mean? 私の祖父は私が誰だったのかお、誰だったのか彼の当時の生活のどのようなものか Oh, okay. That's, that's very nice of you. I'm from California. Oh, Kanazawa-sensei visited at some point in the 80s. Ah, I see. Potentially early 90s. Hey, Anshodan question. Is the second move a punch or a hammer fist? Second movement. This, that's a punch. Just a punch. Purely a punch. <clears throat> okay. I guess we are almost done. How to setting it up. Okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, I gotta get changed and everything too, so. Okay, so let me go back to this. Where was I? Whoop. Yeah, this was the yeah, this was the first video uh, for the toe slide uh, entry drill. Yeah. Okay, I would say most of your toes are closed like this. From here, I like you. So this, you know, I explain step by step in a very detailed, you know, angles, so you can you can see what I'm exactly doing and how you should be um, learning these skills. So anything, you know, if you're struggling to, to, to get better at karate, and if you think you lack the teachings uh, from your local school, this material, the Karate University, the video course itself, uh, is going to help you out uh, for sure, guys. Oh, your, sh your shushin no konsho, oh, was outstanding, thank you. <laughs> Have you practiced with any other Okinawan weapons? Uh, to be honest, no. No, because the bow was the easiest for me to, because I only had a few days to shoot those videos. I couldn't practice other weapons. But, oh, thank you so much. That was my first bow kata, so <laughs> I'm glad I didn't do so, so, you know, so bad. Oh, wish me good luck in fighting in the JK Masters tomorrow. Oh, good luck, good luck, uh, Lucido, good luck, man. Uh, for teaching Japanese, like not as a profession or on YouTube, but maybe like private or group lessons. Uh, private, oh, oh, actually, yes, I did. In the past, I did one, one private lesson uh, who he wanted to learn Japanese and karate. So we split the time into two. In the first, uh, I would think it was like half an hour, we did Japanese. And then in the second hour, or the second half of the hour, uh, we use that Japanese phrase while doing karate. So that's something I can, of course, still do for you. Uh, when, when are you traveling abroad? Hopefully soon, uh, beginning of um, next year, uh, and I think March of 2023, I'm planning to go to a country to hold a seminar. So please look forward to that. Um, 
Oh, I definitely buy your courses, sir. Thank you so much. Uh, what a follower have to do for being on one of your videos? <laughs> Make an invitation, please. <laughs> well, well, what kind of videos do you want to shoot? You know, uh, let me know. If I like your idea, you know, that might be a possibility. Mm, any chance you could do a video with Sensei Seth? Oh, of course, um, I like his videos. It's just a topic that we should come up with together, right? Um, I have a very difficult time with Yokogeri Kekomi. Snap front, front kick? Yokogeri Kekomi means a side kick, thrust side kick, not a front kick. Uh, it hurts my knee and I don't find a good tutorial for that. Can you help? Um, I have I have Kekomi tutorials on YouTube. Maybe you should check that on check that one uh, first Just type in Kekomi uh, space waku. My video should come up <clears throat> Does Karate University have Bunkai? Um, we are making a kata course too in the future So in that we will be uh, covering the Bunkai as well I have a Nidan exam in four weeks. Oh, so of my, so I've been meaning, up, meaning to up the intensity of my training. I definitely consider looking at your courses for at least a minute. Yeah, yeah. I think uh, you can check out the the workouts course for that. Inten in terms of intensity training, yeah, yeah. Check out the workouts course. Okay, guys. <clears throat> so. Guys, do you have any suggestions for videos? I've been considering to make some videos um, related to some karate tutorials. So if you have any, or if you like to watch my reaction videos, um, I can uh, make those as well. Kumite combos. Samantha double punch. This one? Karate fundamentals, like basics, right? Basics. I have a couple of follow along videos on my channel. So maybe those will help you, I think. Mm -hmm. Oh, follower meetup. Yes, 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 of course, of course. I have thought about it, but you know, the followers are all around the world and I currently am in Tokyo. So I can see in my, in my YouTube studios that there aren't a lot of Japanese uh, or, or people living in Japan watching my channel. So it's not, it doesn't really make sense for me to open it in Japan. So, but when I, you know, go to other countries, of course, that is a possibility uh, for sure. Uh, we can do a Zoom meetup. Oh, yes, yes. That's why um, in, the, in the university, uh, we have monthly meetups. So there, um, I, we actually hold it on Zoom. So you can come check me out um, at the Zoom's uh, monthly, I would say, meetup. Yes, yes, Zoom meeting. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we hold that there. Giant killer. She does a block and counter with that punch. Ah, pop, pop. I think Daniel did that too. Maybe that's where she got it from, right? Japanese people are losing their culture in karate and other martial arts. Ah. That is a very critical point. I do agree. Um, I, a lot of a lot of Japanese people are getting less interested in Japanese martial arts. So, actually, there are a lot more karate practitioners outside of Japan, and I heavily um, feel very endangered by that. So, the least I can do is to to I would say accumulate the knowledge as much as a, as much as possible, and keep it on video like this on YouTube, so anybody can look back. 
and future years. Sidekick. Can you show us the sidekick? Which sidekick? <laughs> there are quite a lot. The side snap kick. <laughs> Hey, saludos desde Colombia, sensei. Os. Thank you so much. Muchas gracias. What do you think about a 10 takeaway tutorial of Hirokazu Kanazawa Karate Intensive Book? I don't know what that is. <clears throat> I am not from the Kanazawa family or the Kanazawa system, so I'm not aware of that. <clears throat> but your voice doesn't much your, match your face. <laughs> really. <clears throat> Saludos, Peste Peru. Thank you so much. Why are Japanese people losing interest in karate and other martial arts? Mm, why? Let's see. Mm, why are people losing interest? I think there is a sense of um, getting inspired by things, I would say, outside of your daily life. So martial arts, or I would say old traditions of Japan, I guess this applies for any kind of tradition across the world, but you are somewhat used to those traditions. Like you've heard of it, you experienced it in your youth, and when you grow up, and, you're, and you, set, you start to open up your, your eyes, you see different things all across the world. For instance, oh, basketball seems so popular in the US, or oh, in, in Europe, soccer is so popular, or I don't know, for instance, in cultural aspect, K-pop is going crazy. So people's attention, you know, people always want to see new things. You know, there are, that's why trends are there. So, you know, as a general, I would say principle or as a general w things, just a way that things just go. Tradition tends to be a little bit down downwards when when it faces new trends. So for us, karate is like that. But you know, I guess for other people, you know, who's living outside of Japan, karate is something new, right? It's not something that's in your daily life. So that's why it's so refreshing for you. So it makes more sense. I mean, as a structure, for it to be doing. I would say a lot better outside of Japan. So I'm not sad or I'm not angry or anything. I just see it, I would say. It's, it's not a subjective view, I think. Uh, an object, uh, as an objective view, I see it uh, uh, like that. I can relate to the in endangerment of cultural loss. One of my goals is to return to my home country and learn our own historical martial art, Eskrima. Oh, um, Philippines, right? Mm -hmm. Puedes enviar un saludo para el club de karate Satori. I don't know that. Um, I I've never been to that club before, or I don't know that club. I don't have any plans of going to Peru right now. I think that's what you're trying to ask. <laughs> Sorry, I don't understand your full Spanish. Mm. Sensei, what does it say on your black belt? I don't have it on me right now, but it says my name and the name of the organizations. Uh, do you believe that it is better to travel to Japan to learn Judo as a traditional roots or would a person still get a raw material from the USA? It all depends on the teacher. I don't do Judo, so I cannot distinguish between a good teacher and a bad teacher. Um, but... Um, you know, coming to Japan doesn't mean you'll get the best teacher as well. So I guess learn judo to a certain level. That way you can distinguish whether um, you know this, you you know the quality or not. And I assume you've never done judo before, maybe. So I guess if you don't have an experience, just join a random one, get to a certain level, and then seek for the true. Very authentic one, I think. Goes the same for karate. Um, of course, if you have the time and money, go directly into a sensei. But if not, then go to a just a casual one first. Learn the 
the enjoyment of it, and then come join a authentic one. Like in, in the case of karate, you can come to me. Can you send greetings? Ah, that's what you're saying. Yeah, good luck, Martin. Uh, does UFC MMA affect Japanese people's opinion about karate as well? No. It plays a big part in America. More people are interested in BJJ and have negative views or view it as a tacky. Um, no. Japan, Japanese people, at least the, the ma major, the, I would say the majority, are not influenced by USC slash MMA because it's not as popular as it is in the USA. So um, people see it, of course, as a way to protect yourself and as a martial art or as a, com as a combative, co as a combat method. But there's a bigger aspect of just the way of life or just how you uh, learn to behave, like manner-wise. So it's not such a big, uh, it doesn't have a huge influence, I would say. Mm. Ever since I was young, I've been fascinated with the Japanese culture and martial arts, always connected with any movie, show, video game set in Japan. It's, it's a shame karate and martial arts are dying out. Mm, I agree. It's, I don't think it's dying out, but it is in our, um, our, our, our curriculum in middle school. Everybody takes martial arts, uh, whether kendo, karate, judo, you choose. So it's not going to die, but it's not as popular as it was before, just like any other culture, I think. Um, where are you streaming from? I am at Shinjuku, Shinjuku, Japan. It's the busiest place in Japan, and it's, it's the busiest station in the world, actually. I think the... It has a Guinness World Record of the most people using a train, a single train station. So it looks very common here, but once you walk for 10 minutes down this way, it's the, it's the very hectic Tokyo, <laughs> Tokyo life there. And we're shooting a video course right now, the Karate University, uh, and we are shooting the Karate Workouts uh, videos today. So we're gonna be shooting five different videos, starting from the kicking tutorials, punch, uh, footwork, block, and then the combination, getting all that together and making that into one course. So you can check that out from the Karate University link up above. Do you do Tai Chi? Just once. I've done it once. Oh, have you considered doing analysis on karate characters? I'm actually, um, I'm making <laughs> one YouTube short on, on anime character, so you can check that out. Check that out. It's coming out today. Well, at, at, uh, today in my time, so in around uh, nine hours, it should come out on my channel. Do you believe humans who study martial arts can have chi and supernatural powers like Liu Kang from Mo Mortal Kombat or Liu from Street Fighter? Uh, supernatural powers, no, but what people refer to as chi is basically that feeling, that inner feeling you have. Um, when you, or the inner feeling you picture when you move. So it's, we, it's not gonna foster supernatural powers, but, you, but for, for, for a fact, you will become a lot more sensitive to what's happening to your body. So right now I'm just standing randomly, but when I look down, my feet is in 90 degrees and I can tell that without looking. Like right now my arm, uh, for instance, my, my uh, index finger is around midpoint of my forearm. Like those little things I can tell. When I'm tilting a little bit, I have more weight on my left, left leg right now than my right leg. My neck is a bit tilted to the right. I would say my right shoulder is a little bit tense right now. So all these little points you can notice when you do martial arts. So if you, can, if you, just, you know, define that as, as supernatural, I guess yes. So that, that, that would be my, that would be my um, answer for you. Uh, do you watch any anime? If so, have you watched One Piece and what's your favorite? One Piece is my favorite. I started with, to watch, um, what's it called? The new one. Um, Chainsaw Man. I, I started to watch that. My favorite is One Piece, by far, by far. It has destroyed all the concepts of anime for me. 
Do you have any videos on kata gangaku? Not at the moment. <clears throat> but I will be making one for sure. <clears throat> okay, guys, I guess I will be going very soon. Let me take a few questions left. And yeah, I hope to see you guys um, at the Karate University. Uh, when did you start Karate? I started it when I was uh, 14. 14 or 15. You ever been in Europe? Yes. I've been to France, Spain, Italy, uh, Greece, Greece, Turkey, Georgia. Um, I guess that's it. Yeah, that's it. Um, what's the hardest karate move you can do? <laughs> Hardest karate move. Hardest. Uh, uh, 360 degree kick. <laughs> Have you ever been to any Arab countries? Egypt. I've been to Egypt before. Uh, favorite Heian kata? Heian. Heian godan, I think. It's the most difficult one. Okay, so yeah, thank you guys so much. Guys, again, come check out the uh, Karate University. If you want to make your karate to take, it, take it to the next level, or if you lack th those physical activities, if you want to exercise and use karate, check that out, guys, from the link up above. And like I mentioned, free seven-day trial, so no risk for you. Sign up, try out the videos. If you don't like it, cancel, right? So thank you so much, guys. And I will see you guys uh, later on my live stream or in my future videos. Thank you so much, guys. Have a great day or have a great evening. Bye, guys.